right, welcome back to another video. If you're new here, then my name is Sean. Today I'm going to be reviewing the July Glossy Box. So, Glossy Box is a monthly subscription. Each month you get a box of goodies uh, from skincare to makeup, hair care. I've been with them for three months, but uh, the three boxes I have received have been really varied and absolutely loved them. And each month you get around £60 worth of items inside. Um, so let's go ahead and have a look inside this one. See the box is really pretty. So it says Aloha here along on the front. When we open it inside, the first thing you will see is you get a little booklet. So this booklet tells you everything that is inside the box. I actually don't look at this until I've looked at everything in the box because it's more of like a surprise. But this also tells you the price of everything in the box. The box will also always have uh, a range of full size and sample size products. This box actually contains five full size products um, and everything in this box comes to 70, about, about 70 pounds, 69 pounds something. So let's go through the box. Um, I'm also going to try everything on. I've not worn anything out of this box yet, so it's all going to be first impressions too. So let's go ahead and uh, let's get it on. Okay, so the first thing in the box is these glow drops from Jekka Black. I know her name is Jessica Black, but I'm pretty sure her um, her range is Jekka Black. So these are glow drops and it says in our little booklet, and at 60, 16 pounds, let's, have a look, let's open it and show you. So these come in at 16 pounds. Um, and it says glow drops prep and brighten your complexion with a healthy natural glow up all over your face using your fingertips before makeup. So it's a primer. So it's a highlighting primer. So I'm going to go ahead and pop this on. Like I said, I haven't used anything. Put a little bit out. It's very shiny, shimmery. So let's just pop a bit. I feel like I'm going to need a lot more than that. And just rub it in. This is for wearing under your foundation. Um, I'm from the colour of it. I mean, I've not really rubbed it in properly yet, but from the colour of it, I reckon you could maybe wear it as like not a BB cream, but just just on its own, like a tinted moisturiser almost, because it has got a tint to it. This would have been handy for my. Um, on my makeup video actually because it's a primer as well so it should stay on all day um, I might do a wear test as well and see how it lasts lasts during the day about my finger and just pat it in so it's very glowy it's very shiny I, I could wear that you know I'd be quite happy with just to wear that with no foundation. I, I don't know if it says you can. I mean obviously you can, but I don't know if it says you can do just wear it on its own or with. It just says wear it under your foundation like a primer. Um it feels really nice. It feels really light as well. Um yeah, I'm really happy with that. I would definitely pay £16 for that. As for foundation on, um I've also popped some concealer on under my eyes, on my forehead, on my chin, and down my nose. I'm impressed with that product like how glowy is my skin under my foundation I know I said I could easily wear it without foundation and I happily would um like more of a tint moisturizer um however I wanted to put a foundation on just to give it a proper review and see sort of how it stays and how the foundation looked on top but you'd get away without wearing a highlighter like I've not contoured or anything um, because there is something else in this box that I'm going to show you so I'm not going to contour in my normal way um, but yeah when it comes to highlight I don't think you would need a highlight I mean, you could put a highlight on but I don't think you'd need it so let's get on to what I was just speaking about so the next thing Aloha give them Lala bronzer and this retails at, I will just look in my little booklet and tell you, this retails £19.80. Like, that's insane. £19 a box is from £10 a month, so that's insane. 
as if my nails weren't bad enough I'm now just going to chip them while I'm opening the box. So this is the product, definitely looks bougie, <laughs> it is the colour. So let's have a little play about with this. So let's, it says use a large fluffy brush to apply along your hairline, down your cheekbones and across your jaw. So let's give this a go. So we have a big fluffy brush here and let's just go in. I'm going to give this a good tap off because one, I don't really tend to bronze because I'm super pale. I do wear fake tan now and again. So then that would be a better time to bronze. But for me, I'm more of just a contour girl. So give it a good tap off. So let's go in with this bronzer. Oh my god. That is unreal. Like, look at that. How pretty is that? Oh, I think I'm going to have to do this more often. Oh wow, I am so impressed with that. I need to put a little bit up in my hairline, so you've got to be careful. Well, that's me giving myself a pep talk because I always put too much contour up on my head. Wow, I am incredibly impressed with that. That is so pretty. Oh yes. Yeah, so that is that's a good product and I know when I run out of that I am gonna keep on buying that because it's bronzer. And the next product. This is a this little lip balm. Let's pop it out of the box. Put it the right way around for you. So this is the palm balm and it's by the company The Beauty Crop. Full size, and would you believe that this is eighteen pounds? This retails at eighteen pounds. So this, this little tub of joy says formulated with 90% natural plant-based oils including coconut and apricot oils. Uh, it not only conditions and hydrates your lips, uh, you can also use it as a creamy blush. Now, I'm not a fan of cream blushes as it is. The same with uh, like cheek stains, cheek tints, whatever you want to call them, because I'm just rubbish at applying them um, and I just can't pull it off so I'm not going to use this on my cheek but I'm definitely going to put it on my lips so this is the colour of it doesn't really smell of much at all but uh, give it a go I'm just going to use my finger you can use a brush or whatever you want I'm just using a finger just put it on oh it's conditioning it's very pretty. There, yeah, that's nice, isn't it? And I can see how actually that would look so nice on your cheeks, but I'm not going to do it because I'm actually so happy with how my base is looking right now, especially with that, um, with the bronzer. That's just, oh, I'm so converted to that. I'm so happy with this. The orange juice hand cream and it is by Nail Bay Cosmetics. This retails at £11.50 and it reels so much more expensive than £11.50, it really does. So this uh, says, and I think especially now with all the hand washing, what's better than hand cream? This will just be, hopefully be brilliant. It says this is intensely moisturising formula and it infuses your skin with revitalising nutrients and vitamins that will leave it feeling soft and regenerated. So let's put this on. It's just to massage it through hands and nails. So, oh, oh my god. It literally smells like you've just cut open an orange. Like, honestly, that is all it smells like. Well, I mean, it is orange juice hand cream, so I'd expect it to smell of oranges, but I mean, that is, that's strong, but in a, in a nice way, in a very nice way. So a little bit of hand cream. I'm just going to rub that into my hands. Rig that's very oh my god that is amazing and it feels nice i mean i don't know if this is like a good way to describe a hand cream but it feels like matte i don't know if that's 
like I said, I don't know if that's good, but it feels matte and it feels nice. So it, it just, it's just nice and it dries quick. The amount of hand creams that I've used and you put them on just the tiniest bit and it just stays so wet and sticky for so long and it's just horrible so that is brilliant and for £11.50 that's an absolute steal I don't even pay £11.50 for it but if you were to go and buy this it's only £11.50 so worth it and then there's one more product so this one I'm not going to be using this one I'm going to be saving this one for when I need it um, but obviously I'll show it you so this is a face mask so there's two face masks that you can get so when you get your glossy box sometimes the products vary so people get a variety of different things whereas this one everyone's getting exactly the same but the only thing that is different is the face mask so there's a watermelon one which is what i have and there's also a strawberry one um so if you did get the july box you may have got the strawberry one however they're obviously the same i'm glad i got the watermelon one because i love watermelon not the biggest fan of strawberry uh don't just the full pound. Now this is cool because I actually thought when I first saw this it was just a face mask and then when I looked closer I realised it's not. There are little slices in here which means you can just pop them wherever you need to target that area so you could put on your forehead here here and here. Um, I'm gonna open it. Um, I'm sure it's got a beautiful watermelon scent but uh, yeah, I'm gonna save these. You never know when I use them. I'll I'll take a photo. I'll put it on my Instagram. Go and follow it. I'll put it there. Um, but yeah, these are by Coco Star. Um, I'll tag I'll tag all the Instagrams of everything below. Um, because in this little booklet, everything has an Instagram. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. So everything's got an Instagram. I don't know how well you can see. But it's brilliant and then on the back of the leaflet it also tells you it gives you a little sort of hint into what we're getting next month so next month's actually going to be a special because it is glossy box's birthday so we're getting a special box um, and they're also going to be announcing something big uh which i can't wait for apparently they've been uh, and yeah there's there's lots of things if you sign up with them you get little hints and tips and videos on how to use the products and things it's brilliant um so i am going to apply the rest of my makeup and then I will be back with you for a little review back so I have finished my makeup um our thoughts on the box I am so happy with it um like I said I've only been with them for three months I've only had three boxes this is by far my favorite um I think I think this one has been worth the most they've all been pretty close um they've all been at least 60 pound uh but yeah this one to get five full-size products quality products as well um is for, for that for that much a month is just amazing um so favorite product if you haven't guessed already is definitely this i am so impressed um i'm definitely converted i will still contour i might even contour and put a bit of this on top who knows but yeah i'm, I'm really really um feel is just I've not put any highlighter on and I just don't feel like I need it um I'm gonna review I'm gonna wear it all day and see how it lasts and yeah hopefully fingers crossed it's a decent primer because if it is then these two I will definitely be purchasing again once I run out which I feel like will be a while especially this I feel like this is gonna last me a long time um remember to go and check out my Instagram and my Facebook uh, go and give me a like, a follow on there and yeah, thank you for watching I think I'm going to review every monthly box I get um, especially next month should be a good one apparently because it's their birthday so next month will be exciting but yeah, if you like this video give me a thumbs up, go hit the subscribe button down below if you haven't already and uh, yeah, I'll see you in another video catch you later all day and um yeah, I'm actually so impressed with it. Uh, the primer is my new favourite, which is quite sad because I've just bought a primer, which I had in my last couple of videos, the NYX one, which is amazing. Um, but yeah, if you want a more glowy, dewy look, then this one, obviously, uh, honestly, under your foundation, it's just, it's a no-brainer. It's brilliant. Go subscribe to Glossy Box. You will not be disappointed. Um, and yeah, have, have a good day.